a day in the life. Make a bag. It doesn't take up too much space either. So yeah. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Follow me as I take you through my workday routine, working at 9530 in London. I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning guys. So I woke up at six and then spent 20 minutes dreading having to wake up early, hoping I slept earlier the night before. You know, it's super dark in the morning, so that doesn't really help. Eventually I got out of bed and then left for work around 7.30. I walked to the train station, the sky was a bit gloomy, but grateful for a new day. My journey is an hour long, so I got to work at 8.55am and I started my work. At 10 I went for a food break, I had a banana and then I had a meeting which lasted about an hour and I did some more work. I also did a little elevator dance and luckily I was alone so yeah, hope you like it. At 1 I went for lunch, I am trying very hard to eat a balanced diet, not super healthy but it's not fully unhealthy either, that equals balance you know. <laughs> lunch was good and I appreciate a good lunch. I'm on a lunchtime walk, just had my lunch. And now I'm gonna walk. So yeah, it's a bit cold. It's still a nice day, it's bright. It's not like dark like yesterday. Oh, okay, it's very cold now. I'm gonna get back to the office. My hands are freezing. I can't even type now. Okay, but that was a good walk. Now I'm inside, I'm just warming up. I'm just not a morning person. Half a day is nearly gone, a few more hours. Then I'm heading to the gym. I'm going to do a bit of workout. I'm going to do legs today because yesterday and the day before that and the day before that I think I did upper body. So today I'm going to do legs. Um, so yeah, workout and then go home. Then once I go home, I'm going to have dinner. I'm going to meditate. And I need to do my daily journaling. So that's a few more things I need to do when I get home. So yeah, and then I can call it a day. Finished at 5.30 and I headed to the gym. This bar is so good. I got hungry, so I bought a protein bar to have on the way and to keep me going at the gym until I got home. I also have a parcel to open, so let's do that right now. I was so excited for this parcel. I ordered it like two weeks ago and I've been waiting ever since and then the other day it came but I missed the delivery so I had to reschedule it and then it came three days after so I've been super excited for this anyway there's just a few items that I ordered from Sheen um, so yeah the first is this makeup pouch in this very like beautiful light pink colour oh it's nice and soft A nice soft material oh and it's big I didn't think it was going to be this big I needed a makeup pouch because now I don't use that much makeup like I have a very minimal makeup routine so yeah I needed a small makeup bag so this is it it's super cute nice little pouch makeup bag actually it's a bit too big but I don't mind it it's okay Next I got this um, facial brush, it's made out of silicon so it's very like wobbly and soft but it's nice and cute and it's like cheap so it doesn't take up too much space either so yeah this is just when I wash my face um, this can be a nice little facial brush in the past I used like electronic ones and they just like always run out of battery and it's just not convenient so this is nice and it's not harsh on the face either. Yeah, it's super soft. Oh, and then I got this powder puff. It comes in this little container. So that's nice and you know, you can keep it clean. Um, it seems good quality. So you can, you know, use this to apply powder. It's like, so I think, can't wait to use this. But this part, it's not made up of fabric. It's made up of like a very, I don't know, Let's see how this performs, but yeah, it's nice and soft. This container is really good. It's like proper strong as well. And you know, it keeps the puff um, clean and not dirty. And then I got a, a Apple Watch. 
uh, strap, not strap, but like the whole casing and everything. I wanted a clear Apple Watch strap and case, uh, and I can't wait to use this. Oh, that's gonna look so cool. Yeah, yeah, it's super lightweight. I mean, it seems good quality, and yeah, so can't wait to use this. I wanted this because you know when I go when I use my Apple Watch at the gym, it's kind of nice if you have like a you know like a hard shell case. And then I got a new phone case as well. I got a pair, so I got this brown phone case. Uh, I just wanted a change of you know phone case, so it's a hard phone case. But I really like the brown color. And this also came with a Apple Watch case. So yeah, I can now have a matching airpod and phone case. I really like the colour. And then I got this makeup bag. It's this black mesh fabric. And yeah, it's just meant to be like see-through. It's soft. And it's actually got two compartments. So this is one compartment here. And then like if you close this bit here. It's like an okay quality but you know it does the job and then you have a second compartment here so yeah cute i like it it's nice i can put my makeup brushes in this big compartment and then a few of the other items in the you know in the small in the big compartment so yeah i got another bag as well it's just like another pouch that i got to like i don't know just keep some spare stuff to organize some other spare things and it, this is also a um, mesh fabric and it's this like pink colour and I thought this was like super handy and useful um, the zipper is, works nicely as well so yeah and you know you can keep a few things in here so yeah this was nice as well can't wait to use this, I really like this oh and then lastly I got this tongue scraper thing I just saw it and I was like Hmm, let's try it. Also got this in pink as well. I don't know, I've just been liking pink lately. Just gonna put this. Ooh, it's cute, it's really good quality. It's like metal. Um, but yeah, I got this tongue scraper thing. But yeah, I saw this and I was like, hmm, let's try that. But yeah, that is all. I forgot to show, but I also got this Apple Watch case. Yeah, it's a light pink colour. Yeah, just to customise my Apple Watch a little. Since the start of this year, I have been meditating for 10 minutes daily and then I did my daily journaling, you know, reflecting on the day, writing my gratitude and planning a to-do list for the next day. I'm then ready to go to bed by 10.30. Good night. Thanks for watching. See you in my next video. Bye.